Buenos Aires is a beautiful city. This is the Plaza de Mayo, one of its delightful parks. The Teatro Colón, home of the opera. And the stately Congress building, center of Argentina's government. The tallest building in South America, the Edificio Cavanaugh. Yes, they were really impressed with the big city. But impressive, too, was the lure of the pampas and the Argentine gaucho, as painted by F. Molina Campos. The party were guests at his ranch studio, where Senor Campos paints the gaucho with amazing detail and humor. Seeing these pictures made them more anxious than ever to meet these caballeros in person. And they lived up to their pictures. A real Wild West show, but just part of the day's work for a gaucho. Sketching these paisanos in action was no easy job. But they did manage to get a good look at the gaucho's equipment. Silver coins decorate his belt, or tirador. The sheepskin saddle. Soft horsehide boots. This garment's called a shiripa. Here, the visitors were treated to an asado, choice cuts of meat, mate, the Argentine tea, and wine from their own vineyards. True Argentine hospitality. A group of skilled dancers entertained the guests. Not the modern tango of Buenos Aires, but the country dances of the Argentine. The same tunes to which their grandparents had danced. how closely these steps resemble the old time square dances of North America. Gathering picture material here was a pleasure. Another story was underway. And after seeing Senor Campo's paintings and all this colorful exhibition, we couldn't help but compare the life of the Argentine gaucho with that of our own cowboy. And they reached way back into Texas to find 